Manchester United could turn to Ralph Rangnick if they're forced into sacking Ole Gunnar Solskjaer. Manchester United may move for Ralph Rangnick if they're forced into pulling the trigger on Ole Gunnar Solskjaer's turbulent Old Trafford reign. The 63-year-old is currently working at Lokomotiv Moscow in Russia. But Express Sport will now take a look at how the Red Devils could line up under the veteran in his favoured 4-2-2-2 formation. Goalkeeper, De Gea, at the end of last season, it looked like David De Gea was on the wane. The Spain international toiled during the Europa League final defeat to Villarreal, failing to save a single penalty in the shootout and missing his own effort from 12 yards. However, De Gea has bounced back this term, his mistake against Manchester City on Saturday aside, the 31-year-old has started to resemble the goalkeeper he was during Jose Mourinho's time at the helm, and though Dean Henderson is waiting in the wings, there's very little chance of De Gea being dropped on current form. Defence, Juan Bissaka, Varane, Maguire, sure, though Harry Maguire is United's costliest centre-back of all time, he's endured a tough campaign so far, and if Rangnick comes in, he may choose to drop the England international to the bench, something Solskjaer has flatly refused to do so far, therefore, when everybody's fit, Victor Lindelof and Raphael Varane could be partners at centre-back, both are better on the ball than Maguire and, with Rangnick likely to want results to improve right away, their partnership could be the way to go, and though Aaron Juan Bissaka and Luke Shaw have struggled in recent recent weeks, it's feasible they'd keep their places in the team. Midfield, Fernandez, Fred, with Rangnick liking to play with two midfielders, two wingers and two forwards, it's time to get creative, and one option for the German, in order to use his favoured system, could be to deploy Bruno Fernandez further back, playing him alongside Fred would ensure the Red Devils have style and solidarity in the middle of the park.